going to share some tips on how to succeed in your study. Rule number one, attend all classes. That is especially true for language courses. Rule number two, don't be late. Remember, one missed class means one last point. If you got sick and missed classes, call the doctor, get medical certificate and submit it to KIMAP Medical Center. If you have family or personal issues, inform instructor and contact us ASAP. Remember, do not cheat or plagiarize. You may get an F grade for the course and be sent to the disciplinary committee. Important, always check on your deadlines. In case if you fail to submit an assignment on time, you will lose points or get zero points. Every single point matters because it will influence your GPA. To calculate the GPA, go to the student portal, choose study, find grades and assessments icon, click on it and you will see online GPA calculator. Choose the number of courses you are going to take, put most possible grades and press get forecast GPA. If you are not happy with your grade, apply for an appeal, go to the student portal, choose the forms section. Do you see the grade appeal icon? Click on it, fill and submit the form. Remember, you have only 72 hours to appeal the grade once it is posted. If you failed the course, you have to retake it as soon as possible to improve your GPA. You may retake any course to improve your grade except the history of Kazakhstan. If you receive at least D- for modern history of Kazakhstan, you cannot take it again. If you wish to earn state diploma with honors, the grade for history of Kazakhstan should be A. If you think that you may fail the course, you better drop it. You can drop the courses no more than 10 times during your study at KIMAP. Last date to withdraw from the course is stated in the academic calendar. Remember, if you withdraw from a course during the first five weeks of the semester, you may receive a refund. Important, there will be no refund after fifth week of the semester. The grade of withdrawal does not affect your GPA, but if the course is required, you should pay and take it again. Parents will be informed if you withdraw from the course. If you miss final assessment and have an excuse for it, the instructor may give you an incomplete grade. The incomplete grade does not affect your GPA and gives you time for completion of final exam. Please note, to receive the incomplete grade, you should provide all needed documents, such as medical certificates, free request of explanation of family or personal issues. If you miss classes, demonstrate poor performance, or have GPA below 2, you are identified as a risk student and your parents will be informed about it. If you have already taken 24 credits and your GPA is below 2, you are put on academic probation. Registration for courses is blocked and requires advisor's permission, and registration is limited to 12 credits in the fall and spring semesters and 6 credits on summer. You also must participate in the academic support program, and finally, your parents will be informed about your academic status. If you are a special needs student, Learning Support Center will offer you academic support such as extended time for exam or paper submission, desirable schedule, and etc. To receive support, you should submit medical documents to the KIMEP U Medical Center and contact Learning Support Center coordinator. All students are required to register for the courses on fall and spring semesters. If a student does not register for the classes, does not request an academic leave, he or she will be administratively withdrawn from the KIMAP University. A student may request academic leave by submitting an academic leave form to the Registrar Office. How to apply? Here we go. Fill the form on the student portal in the form section, clicking on Academic Leave icon. Print, sign, scan and send the form and all required documents to the mail and receive an approval. A student must complete all four English courses before 45 credits and Kazakh Russian languages before 75 credits. If you have any questions, issues or concerns, please contact us.